Hello, um, I just wanted to present to you our new citizen science portal. I will uh, very briefly, it's very similar to the former one. Here you have a map of um, the data which have been recorded uh, previously and you can um, zoom on them and when you over um, above the bubble and you will see the name of the place which has been uh, cleaned and the weight in plastic which it contains and uh, so at the bottom you have the totals of um, weight uh, which are recorded the number of cleanups which are recorded and the number of sites which are registered so as previously you can <coughs> visualize the data for a specific place so you can choose the beach where um, you want to see the data from of course that's from Balnakil where we recorded loads of data and you can see in in um, red what has been the, the pollution rate estimated from the different cleanups and this is the cumulative curve showing um, showing everything which has been collected since record and every time with this uh, kind of curves you can uh, you can visualize the exact data this has the advantage to have an overview of the rate of pollution with the slope of this curve um, this is not finalized but this is uh, the old system of submission form so you have a map with all the sites uh, which have been Recorded. So if you want, uh, you can choose one site here. Here it's on Tyree. It should work. Uh, of course, it's not working. I have not. Why is it not working? I don't know. Maybe it's a bit slow. Ah, here now it's working so I've selected one of the sites and here you can see uh, the former recording so you can check if you've recorded data for this uh, in this zone or not or if someone has recorded data from a previous clean and this selects uh, the, the site uh, place and here you can choose uh, when is the date of your clean and you, you enter the waiting cleanup and then you submit here um, there will everybody will be a registered user so we can keep track and we'll have also options to upload pictures and other information the new thing is that we'll be able to register uh, new sites so that works in a in a correlation with uh, the map here so you can see here there is a cross so if i want to add a site here you will have to have for example here you put the cross in the middle of the the location and this cross will fill up the coordinates here and you will have to add the name so if you're not sure of the name the best is to consult the US map so if you click here you will uh, go directly um, to OS map uh, place correspond corresponding and we can't see any name maybe we need to zoom more I will fuck that US map with provided a name oh here you go here is a, is the name so you can call it by one of these names which you, you find appropriate so please don't invent names uh, use uh, the US map uh, that's it for now.